In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect your Google Workspace domain to Wix. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to be talking about the two main ways in which you will be able to connect your Google Workspace domain to Wix. This is going to depend on how you were originally connected your, your domain to your Wix site. So first, if you purchased your domain through Google Domains and you selected Wix as the website builder of choice, you don't have to worry. This is because the domain should already be connected to Wix. So to confirm and complete the setup, all that you have to do is first upgrade the Wix site if needed. So free Wix plans might have limitations using custom design. So you might need to upgrade your Wix plan to connect the Google Workspace domain. And next, log into your Wix account, go to your website settings and look for a section related to the domains that you have connected to your account. If you notice that there is already a domain listed here or under my domains, it is going to tell you that you have connected the Google Workspace domain successfully. As you can see, if you don't see anything listed here, then it could indicate that the connection was not established. And afterwards, since your domain should already be connected to Wix, you can proceed with setting up Google Workspace services like email using the domain name. Just follow the Google Workspace setup guide. Now, if you purchased your domain elsewhere and you connected it to Wix, then you will need to add the Google Workspace MX records to your domain's DNS settings. So log into your domain registrar, access the control panel of your domain registrar where you manage your domain's DNS settings. This might be Google Domains, Namecheap, GoDaddy, etc. Now locate DNS managements and tap the option to add new records. You will be able to find the specific Google Workspace MX records that you need to add under this support page on Google. So go over to Google Workspace Admin Help and look for Troubleshoot MX Records. As you can see here, the MX records that you need to use are going to be listed under step 2. So all that you have to do here is check them using an MX lookup tool or see if they are applied to your primary domain. And if they are or aren't, make sure that you add them there, save the changes and then set up Google Workspace. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Google Workspace to Wix. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.